God loves singles. Oh yes, if you're single, you're watching me now and you're single, God loves you. Hallelujah, glory to God. Welcome to Papa San Marita Bliss with Pastor Honorine. I promised us in a previous video, the link is in the description box, that I was going to explain to us how much God loves you being single. I didn't say God loves you unmarried. God wants you to be married, but he loves you you being single we have if you if you didn't watch where we defined just check the, the 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 previous videos you're going to understand what sing what we are talking about but we established that singleness that to be single means to be whole to be complete and and to be unbroken and god so loves you that way that one god created man male and female as singles god created humanity as singles secondly god never intended for your singleness to end when you get married as a matter of fact god says that when you get married when the man leaves the wife and the two become joined together he says they, they are, 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 and, and is joined to his wife god says the two should still come back to becoming one flesh it means the two should come back to being single that is how much god loves singleness that is how much god wants you to be whole to be complete to be unique and to be unbroken that's how intentional god was i told us i mentioned the fact that God's initial intention is his final decision because that was God's initial intention. God says, okay, now God did not create the woman and tell Adam that this is your wife. God, no, God created him a helpmate. Adam is the one that declared that this was his wife. And God says, okay, if this is your wife, Matthew 19, 3, three to six he says if this is your wife then they, they, for this reason the, for the reason that you've chosen that this should be your wife the man and the man shall leave his father and his mother and be joined to the work to his wife and the two will still go back to becoming one flesh you'll still go back to being single because my intention was that man should be unique whole and complete unbroken so even if you are married the two are still the, the two as a couple are still supposed to be unique whole complete and unbroken that is when marriage is going to work god loves you single so much so that your marriage does not put an end to singleness your marriage still requires you to be single as a matter of fact it is until god has realized that you've attained singleness that he tells you now it is not good for you to be alone. So you are ready for marriage when you attain the, the state, the level of singleness. And when you are married, marriage doesn't stop singleness. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe if you haven't done that yet. And do not forget the notification bell. Right now we are going, we have, we have been dealing with this series singleness. If you did not see the previous videos, we are going to take one week to handle this. Just please check in the description box for the, for the, <laughs> check the description box for the links. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the links of the previous videos. Or you can simply just go to my page and you're going to see the videos there and it's going to help you you understand better if you follow the vi the videos if you follow them all you're going to understand better as if god as god permits we are going to have a live session to put all of this together and talk about it in a live session but for now follow the videos and you'll still be as blessed you'll learn a lot i guarantee you god bless you shalom